As we continue to make our way through some very cold conditions this winter, Erie News Now is making it our mission to help you navigate the high cost of the cold. Yeah, with temperatures down into the single digits like we saw a couple of times this week and it's still pretty chilly out there this morning, some people might be looking to stock up on some extra layers of clothes. That's always the theme this time of year, right? Layer up. Yeah, layer up, but without breaking the bank, too, right. is also the mission of some folks. Arlena Jonathan joining us live outside the Erie City Mission Thrifty Shoppers Store this morning on how they're helping the community stay warm. Good morning, Elena. Hey, good morning, Mark in Brissa. It can be kind of a challenge to stay warm, especially if you don't have access to all of those brand new coats, gloves, hats, and scarves. But good thing the city mission here at Thrifty Shopper in Erie and in Girard has you covered for the winter season. At the Erie City Mission's Thrifty Shopper locations, the Girard manager, Monica Rosenthal, says there are many customers looking to save a couple bucks on winter essentials super affordable and then things go on sale here constantly. This time of year, folks in Erie are looking for those coats, hats, gloves and boots to get them through the winter. Luckily for shoppers at the Thrifty Shopper. For for kids, you're looking at probably $4.99, $5.99, um, maybe a little bit higher if it's, you know, better name brand. Um, for adults, we're looking probably $9.99, $12.99, something like that. Great deals keep shopper Anna West coming back to the Gerard Thrifty Shopper. After moving here from Baltimore, West says she visits the store weekly. Coming into the store, you never know what you're going to find, and you're going to find some really neat things like this for $4. <laughs> I mean, it's like $4 for this. That you, can, you can't pass up. Not only is West a frequent shopper, but she also frequently donates to the mission too. Every year I go through my closet, see what fits, what doesn't fit, and what doesn't fit, I donate. Rosenthal says she appreciates people like West for donating clothes, especially this time of year when the demand for winter items is so high. <laughs> Donations tend to drop off this time of year because of the weather, um, so our stock tends to run a little bit lower. So um, there's less of a fight at the back door for you know for people if they want to come. All they've got to do is ring our doorbell. We'll come out and get their donations for them. At both the Erie location and the Gerard location, when I was at the Gerard one, there was a good amount of coats, gloves, hats, and everything you need for the winter, but they could always use more. You can drop it off here at the Erie location or over at the Gerard location, and anything that doesn't get bought up gets donated back into the community, so it's a really good thing to donate to if you have something laying around. Live in Erie, Elena Jonathan, Erie News Now.